Yo, what's up, guys? So we're back on the Den Days Alt account. It went me scroll. There we go. We're back on the Den Days Alt account. I know we're gonna be doing a little cool this, a little bit of that, a little bit of everything. But what we're gonna be doing in this video, I know you guys might not like it, but I'm gonna do it just for my sanity and my enjoyment of not wanting to cry. I'm gonna be going ahead. I'm not gonna be buying the most OP fruit. I'm just gonna be buying the ice fruit here for 750 Robux, just so that I don't go absolutely crazy grinding and not enjoying myself because at least this has an m1 and i get immunity as well so that way i'm not going ballistic trying to do this and trying to like kite them away like this it's just not going to be fun for me at all so i'd rather have the immunity there to where i can kind of just sit there and just mind numbingly <laughs> click away you know so yeah the goals of this video is obviously to get level 50 get enough money to then go roll an actual fruit maybe we go ahead and get the buddha fruit we get something good and we can try to stack up the inventory as well of this account and obviously we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna need to get some more codes so let's go ahead and get some more codes real quick all right so there we go we go ahead and we got 40 minutes of codes again so let's go ahead and go ahead let's go ahead and go ahead and get the first quest here we're obviously over here on the pirate island as well now so it's gonna be a lot more easier now like obviously i'm not gonna be able to until i get the mastery up i believe is when i get the thing oh hold up we don't even have any points so i don't know what we're actually gonna need to do is so we're gonna go ahead and need to get ourselves a little reset token so let's go ahead and get that as well all right so there we go we've now go ahead and we've got the little reset bonus here, as you guys can see at the top so now we can go in here and reset all of our stats i think we're gonna go 50 blocks fruits maybe 10 into 10 into melee Okay, maybe 20 into melee, and then we'll just go the rest into box roots again. Now we'll see. Do these guys hurt me? Okay, no, they still do. I think I just got to go ahead and level up the mastery just a tad bit. So let's just get that going. I don't know when I become immune, but I'm pretty sure I do eventually become immune to these guys. Is it this? Yeah, I don't know when I get immune, actually. I think it's because they're level 35 and I'm level 31, actually. But yeah, like this is still just a lot better than all right, if I pull out the katana. Like The katana doesn't swing nearly as fast, and obviously... I have the moves of this guy as well. And this is obviously just going to help me grind through the levels here. Because as you guys can see, it's much, much faster. There we go. Is that going to be level 35? That's going to be level 35 and plus 36 as well. So now we're level 36. Now let's go ahead and get the next quest as well here. And let's see now. We should be completely immune to these guys. There we go. Now we're completely immune. That's what we want. Because now what I can do is I can just go ahead and stack all of them up. You can get all four, group them up, and I can legit just click away. Now, I know this kind of makes it a lot easier for me, but that's what I find more fun instead of sitting there like this trying to like jiggle, jiggle back and forth with them. It's kind of more, um, it kind of takes away thing, but it's like if... If I was to spin a fruit, I probably would have got something that would have gave me immunity anyways. So I think personally, it's perfectly fine. And a lot of people that I've seen on YouTube do a lot worse than what I've done. Like they go ahead and they buy themselves the Buddha fruit, which is obviously the best fruit to, to thing to grind with. They get themselves double money. They get themselves dark blade. They get themselves this. They get themselves double boss drops and fast boats. They get themselves a bunch of ridiculous stuff that you do not really need like okay so we've got ourselves a little scumbag here that's just weird okay it's fine though. but yeah in my opinion the only thing you really need to get from the store is maybe once you get a little bit more late game is double mastery because once you start getting up to like the higher levels of fruits like if you wanted to do the kitsune for say you have to get mastery 300 and not having double mastery can hinder your progression but obviously if you're a grinder you're a grinder you're gonna get it done regardless yeah where are you going you know this is a very um yeah i was about to say this is a very uh low populated lobby here okay there we go i'm just gonna finish this quest there's no point in me really moving on to the next quest until i can play this i'm gonna get lots of xp but yeah well why does that say question mark i think that was weird i don't know why it says question mark is it free <laughs> but yeah let me know down in the comments if you guys prefer these shorter style videos that i'm going to be posting these like i don't obviously want to rush through the game i want to enjoy myself and take it kind of step by step so i can actually 
it's actually like kind of a walkthrough, I guess you could say, so you guys can kind of see how the game's actually played instead of a lot of these people just buying everything and then pretty much just running through the game with the best stuff. Because that's obviously not realistic for someone that's pay to winning. It's kind of like, that's why I went with the ice fruit. Because the ice fruit, you can realistically get it pretty quickly. Like, if you can, you probably spin maybe five times at the gacha. And you're gonna get it. And obviously we're on to the next quest here, which is gonna be good for us. But yeah, if you guys do enjoy this series, please be sure to like this video. It really does help grow this channel. I am trying to get 5,000 subscribers. And... Oh, they can hit me. That's not good. Back up. Back up. No zitchy. Go ahead and grab the next quest. We've also got the next move here. Ice... Surge. I don't know if it's a good move. We'll go ahead and check on the next few mobs here. See now I was going to I was gonna get the flame fruit so it wasn't as expensive. But the flame fruit doesn't have an M1 ability, so I was kind of like I wanna get something with an M1 ability. So that way it kind of makes this a little bit um Whoa, okay, that's pretty good. Makes this kind of a little bit easier for myself as well. Just because then once I can go ahead and I get to the ice village, I can then get myself full body hockey and it's going to be a lot easier with to get full body hockey when i'm um obviously using this for you can't hit me anymore so we are chilling on that and i do do giveaways as well i've um like no i can go ahead bobby he's going to be able to hit me but we should be able to go ahead and loot him out Yeah, see, he's just gonna get absolutely blitzed. Oh, okay! Bobby's a maniac, it looks like. He got me. So good though, we just go back. He's gonna be one shot. Boom! Bobby. Damn. I don't know when the next quest is, so I think we're just gonna go ahead and run through these pirates here. And we should go ahead and be able to move on. I think it's level 60 for the next island. I'm not too sure. But I think we will see. Alright, there we go. Knew it was level 60. Now we can go ahead and go to the desert. Alright. Can they hit me? They can't even hit me yet. So, that's perfect. Let's... Now we can just... I'm kind of in that train... In that mind thought of... I'm going to just hit a like on this video. The... The... Admiral... Alrighty, there we go. We're now we're now level seventy six on the next quest. However, that's actually gonna go ahead, and that's gonna be the end of the video. I know, obviously, that's gonna be the end of the video. I do hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please sure to like, subscribe, and comment if you did enjoy. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out and love.